Hey guys, behind me is the Ram 1500 and it's about to be released to the world. We're on stage at Kobo Center in the Ram booth, but we got a behind the scenes look at the new Ram 1500 for 2019 with all the guys that built it, designed it and put it together. You know, as we were beginning to design the new Ram, we were certainly focusing on maximizing our performance and durability, but we also wanted to focus on technology and efficiency. And so what you have here is our new addition, newest addition from our electrification family, it's our e-torque system. It's a 48 volt system. We use this to basically start and stop the engine. Uh, very seamlessly, we do that under four tenths of a second. The engine is just running and we use that to stop as well. The system also takes energy when you're slowing the vehicle down. It helps slow the vehicle down so you don't use your brakes as much. And we use that to store uh, electricity in the 48 volt battery. So you know, as we look at the system here on, on our Hemi engine, uh, it's, it's actually a belt driven system as you can see in the front. Uh, the system is very similar to what's in the Wrangler. Uh, the Wrangler obviously is on a two liter engine. This is on a, on a V8 engine. So on this system, on the, on the V8, it's 130 pound feet of torque that the, the system is capable of, of using and, and su supplementing the engine with. Uh, basically on this engine, we use the torque to start and stop the engine as, as I'd mentioned and help slow the vehicle down uh, to recover energy uh, to help with our fuel economy. Also we use the system for uh, as we transition from four cylinder to eight cylinder modes uh, to help smooth those transitions out and then also in four cylinder mode many times you're just trying to tip into the vehicle for a little bit more performance. Uh, we actually use this to help boost that to stay in four cylinder mode longer uh, to actually maximize our fuel efficiency of the vehicle. So basically it's addition of the e-torque system on this. Uh, we've done some enhanced controls with the engine and, and our new uh, gearbox as well. We've upgraded the gearbox um, for some efficiency improvements and we've integrated the controls from e-torque system engine and gearbox to maximize our, our performance capabilities. So the transmission, we have two transmissions. It's our eight-speed transmissions. We have a heavy-duty and a light-duty uh, transmission depending on which, which version and which powertrain you choose. We've done some uh, enhancements in the gearbox to, to improve the efficiency of the gearbox slightly from what we have today. And then also we have over 40 different shift schedules we can choose in the transmission. So the e-torque system will help depending on what the driver wants to have accomplished in the vehicle. It'll help uh, balance between the engine, the transmission, and choose the right shift schedules uh, to maximize performance. It also knows if we're towing or going up and downhill and will help select those. Inside the vehicle there's a new uh, driver select module for, for the Prindle systems and around that are different driver select modes as well that the driver can actually choose and then the eTorque system will automatically deploy those for the driver. You know the all-new 2019 Ram 1500 is a no compromise truck and it really expands our portfolio by taking ownership and really changing the way our customers uh, think about overall um, power and efficiency, technology, and luxury. But at the same time, taking our uh, capability to the next level for the new 1500 Ram. 2,300 pounds of payload, uh, 12,750 pounds of towing is, is really unheard of for a, uh, for a light duty truck. And I can tell you this new uh, Ram 1500 will, will do it with ease. We've, we've had a lot of conversation with our, uh, with our customers. As you know, we, have, uh, we started introducing an RAM uh, Ram non-crosshair grill uh, on our premium uh, trims a couple of years ago and, uh, and on the uh, off-road trucks with, uh, with Rebel and Power Wagon. And uh, they really do represent uh, you know, where the, the brand is going. So you see it here, you see that grill here across the range. And uh, we hope our customers uh, like where we're taking the brand. You know, we uh, had a good year uh, last year with, uh, uh, with Ram growing uh, sales and share um, again you know, for the year and, and uh, you know, attracting new customers to the brand. And, and uh, we really want uh, the new truck to continue to bring more uh, customers and, and uh, keep moving us up the ladder on the sales ring. Um, but what's really important to us too is, is our customers that we're attracting are staying with us. You know, the Ram 1500 has got the highest loyalty in the segment uh, and we, we're sure that this uh, uh, new truck with all of the luxury and capability and, and technology and fuel economy and power that you just talked about will attract new customers to the brand and uh, we like keeping them around for life. So it's, uh, it's a really good addition to the range. When you look at what we've got with our e-torque technology, uh, we're adding performance to our uh, to our powertrains, both the the 36 V6 and the 57 Hemi, um, and we're adding fuel economy at the same time. So you think about it this way: the the Hemi today has 410 pounds of torque. We're adding another 130 with our mild hybrid technology. So we're helping with fuel economy, but we're also adding to the performance feel that you've got to really make uh, the uh, the Ram um, give you 
the performance and the efficiency at the same time. Now what we don't yet know for the Ram is the fuel economy, the starting price, or exactly when that diesel will be coming, but we'll know that information very soon. For OurAutoExpert.com, I'm Rick Meyer.